welcome back to Tracy's Pages. Today is day 30 of May I Scrap Lift You. I've got a wet sleeve. I've been playing in my fish tank. Never mind. Today we I am scrapbooking Jennifer Johnson, who's also known as H Clappy on Instagram. And to be honest, this is a lovely, lovely, simple layout that has great effect. So this excuse the glare, is the layout. As you can see, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So that's the layout I'm using. It's The photo I'm using is a picture taken in 2022 in the rugby season for the kids. Tanner would have been playing, but Freddie wasn't as much as Freddie wanted to play. So Wade with Freddie watching Tanner. I'm going to use my tag... Uh, dye. I have got some in my little container. I'm not sure which ones I'm going to use, but anyway, I've got some flare from Dotty about flare. I have got this autumn chipboard by Carter Bella, and this one, as you can see, all the leaves are falling, so it's definitely autumn. And I have got Um, a bit of paper left over from who is this? It says Bo Baby, so Boho Baby. So I'm not sure. <laughs> really good when I cut half the tag off, and I don't know. Maybe it's Bo Bunny, Boho Baby. I got it for the flowers. The other piece I've got here is from Craft Concepts, which this is um, vintage grunge. And on the back it's some polka dots and this one here is photo play everything's upside down back to front four rocks so I have also got this uh, Echo Park element stickers so I don't know what I'm going to use because I never do so I'll put that to the side for when it's time to use that uh, I might have to move things around. Gus is telling us a story about how we went to the fish shop this morning. He went for a big ride in the car and he got some fish. Didn't we Gus? He likes going for rides in the car, does our Gus? So we'll trim the oops. Trim the border. Let's get it straight. Look at that. Oh, see? Look, look, lucky I checked. Lucky I checked. A beautiful sunny day outside. It's not very warm though. Again, it's. It's, yeah. What? Winter is here. That's alright. Yeah. Oh, we don't do Thanksgiving, so that's okay. Thanksgiving is a very American Canadian. So yeah, so it's um, Sunday here and I've got to think, I had a migraine all day yesterday, I think the problem is I'm still, my computer screens at work are tiny and even with glasses on them, I'm having struggle. I'm having to squint all day to see what I'm reading. I have asked them to get me a bigger screen, so I can make the font and things bigger. I am waiting, but if it keeps giving me migraines, I'm not going to be impressed. Having suffered from migraines all of my life, it's not something I enjoy. The day after and the day after the migraines are even worse. The hangover when you feel like you've been hit by a Mac truck. Anyway, that's all right. So what I've done, I've cut it down a little bit because I don't know if I'm. I'm going to do a bit more of a border than. Oh, I do like that. Um, it's very cold. I'm going to have to wipe my gun up. I am putting a border all the way around it where um, Jennifer. She's just put the the ones down the side. And I'm not going to gut this paper. I've got so much paper that I've had for years. It's one thing I, I don't lack is scrapbooking paper. I have got... Oh, 
one, two, four, two, four big cubby holes full of it, and then I've got a, I've got a little stacking shelf up the top with all my different collection collections in. Does that look even? Does it look even? No. Oh, it's going to be one of these days. It's not even. Put that there. So that's 12 inch. I'll put it there. Yeah, that's better. Now I just need to go up. <laughs> Got it. I have sussed it. Right. So today is the second to last day of my I scrapped off you. That was so much fun. It's made the month of May absolutely fly by. Even though tomorrow in New Zealand is actually the 27th of May and it is my baby's 24th birthday. Time has flown. Gus, would you like to go out? I've shut the door, excuse me. He wants to go out. Can you help out of the way so I can get up? Thank you, my darling. Is that good boy? Off you go. Go and see what you can see. What is out there? All right. Somebody's annoying him. So, um, yeah, so now I have to do some cutting. So I'm going to put you on standby, cut some things out, and I'll be back in a lick. Lickety split. Right. So I found some, um, some stuff. I did. Let's come on here. What I need to do is sort this out so it's actually on board. I need to maybe right, that one. So I need to make a square. It's got little brown love hearts on it. I need to find my corner trimmer. Which I do believe will be down here somewhere. There's one. This one will do. I'm going to trim the corners. Creative Memories one that I don't know where I got it from again. Because I must have gone to a... Yes, that one. Creative Memories party at some point. So I'm going to use that one. Make sure we get our hearts the right way around. That one. And then I want a nice long one. And I'm wondering if I... If... Hmm. Seems like such a shame to get into this beautiful... If I do it, I can do it so I can... Um, I may be able to get a fussy cut flower out of here. Not that I'm very good at fussy cutting. I'm going to round the corners of that too. Soften it up. So it's quite nice to bring a little bit of floral in. But um, I'm using a different uh, style tag to what Jennifer used. And I think... Oh, that's pretty. I need to have a, um, a bit of a... Oh, gee, I'll cut the bottom off. I'm talking to myself. I'm sorry. I'm thinking and concentrating, learning that. You'll learn. I go very quiet. Oops. Tack of the dice. That go there. That might go there. I don't know if this green's going to work. But I can't put yellow. I wanted to use the yellow, but I can't really put yellow on yellow. But anyway, let's have a look. Again, I'm sticking quite close to Jennifer's original layout. And we need to move it over a bit because I, as I say, when I when I'm when I scrap lift, it's because I like the page. I have made it a bit different by using the solid background, just to be different. Um, just to be different, which Jennifer has got a nice planer 
background in behind her photos and that where I'm using a pattern paper. I don't often use pattern, two lots of pattern papers. Which one do we want? Do we want that one she's got? Yeah, that might do. And she's also got, oops, she's pure. Now she's got a few little embellishment cluster here. As you see, I've used an upside down tag. Jennifer's picture's a bit smaller. She looks like she's used a three by five, where I've cut down a six by four using a smaller um, die. Up for. There was something on here that caught my eyes. I think it might have been the tags. <laughs> In Christchurch where I live we have it's a very old an old city but we've got lovely at Hagley Park which is a big park in the middle of town it's huge we there are lots and lots of um, oak trees and in winter or fall or autumn autumn or fall, or fall we um, the sea, the roads are absolutely a sea of leaves. It's it's beautiful. It's a pain in the bun, but it is absolutely beautiful. Also, so I might just do that. So that might be that's what I wanted to do. That. Let's have a look. We're just looking. I'm going to put you back on pause soon. And um Oh, I wonder. I'll put you back on pause soon and find some more things because my, my videos are getting a bit long and a bit drawn out. So I'll put you back on pause, get what I need to done and come back when it's just about ready to be finished and we can do the rest from there. Thank you. Hold on a second. I'll be back in the flash of a, the twinkle of a, of a star. So I'm back, I got a bit carried away and I started sticking things down, but that's all right. See, in, in Kiwi land, the land down here, we don't have pumpkins in autumn. <laughs> I mean, well we do, I suppose we are coming into, we do, I lie, we do have pumpkins. Because my pumpkin vine that my chickens grew just, um, has just died off. But, as fall is not a bigger deal here as it is in America I don't know why but anyway it's lovely it's beautiful here with all the leaves um, falling off the trees and so never mind I'm mumbling again I, I tend to mumble I do apologize um, probably because I'm half deaf and I don't know what I'm talking about anyway so I'm just simply going to call this one autumn because I want to use it um, use these up it's quite a bit stuck out I've taken what I did with the leaves down here I actually peeled some of the the chipboard off so it laid a bit flatter but I'm not going to do that for here I need to glue that down hey who I remember how to spell A U T A Keep it straight, stupid. A U T U M And that's my take on Jennifer's layout. 
and we're done. I'd like to thank Jennifer for allowing me to scrap lift you. You can find Jennifer on, as I say, H Clappy over on Instagram. I will put her link below. And tomorrow, guys, is the last day. That will be May I Scrap Lift You over and done for another year. And it was the first time I've actually done just about, I won't say all of the pages because I did miss a couple of, a couple of days, but I will catch those up at some point because I will feel like I have not completed my assignment and one must complete one's assignment. I will stick my flare down and call it done. Thanks everyone, we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> nice and simple. I find these are the pages I like to do the most. Jennifer, that's beautiful. Diverging, diver, uh, di, di, I'm um, whatever. I, I'm going to go off to school tomorrow and learn how to speak English. I diverse. I am diversing. <laughs>